What's up guys? Today I'm going to show you where is the splines from 3ds Max in Blender, okay? So this one. Okay, so let's jump to Blender and if you want to create a spline, you have to press Shift A and then go to Curve and you have a lot of options as you can see. Let's press Line and if you select the vertices, you can edit it. And if you select the entire line and press right click, go to the set spline type poly. And this line will become a poly, so it won't be a busy air anymore. Okay, now select everything, press right click, go to the set spline type and busy air. And you have these little arrows where you can deform the line. Okay, select everything again. Uh, right click and NURBS. So this is another type. And you have a similar one uh, in 3ds Max as well. Okay, select everything again and let's subdivide it. Right click and go to subdivide so you can subdivide the vertex. So let's try another shape. Uh, Shift A and let's try circle. And as you can see, we can do the same thing we did previously. Okay, uh, the same function. Shift J again, and you can choose another one. Let's try this polygon. I have this another one, polygon app. So I recommend you go uh, through all these uh, this shapes, okay? If you go to the Edit tab, you're going to see that we have a lot of things that's very similar from 3ds Max, okay? Like this fillet chamfer, where you can increase radio, and have this very nice chamfer on the vertex. Okay guys, thanks very much for watching and see you in the next video.